Okay, so I got my hands on the beta version of the Tangem wallet ring, and I've been messing around with it for a while now. And of course I had a ton of questions, so I asked Tangem as many questions as I could to get as many answers as I could for you and for myself. So this is everything you need to know so far about Tangem's new self-custodial cold storage ring. So first, what is the Tangem ring? It's a first-gen crypto wallet that takes Tangem's user-friendly approach from their card style wallets and transforms it into a fashionable and functionable cold storage ring. The ring basically has all the same elements that Tangem's current while it has it uses near field communication or nfc technology to connect to your phone where you can manage your wallet and for security it uses an eal 6 plus secure element chip to securely store your wallet's private key we can also expect the ring to come with one or two backup cards and it will also be just as durable as the current tangent wallet it's made of zirconium dioxide which is a strong ceramic material often used in rings and joint implants for example so just like the cards it will be ip68 rated meaning it's waterproof dustproof and resistant to extreme temperatures it's also scratch and shatterproof but it can still be cut off your finger in case of an emergency situation so you can do all the normal stuff with it just like you would any other ring you can wash your hands go to the beach with it bang it on a bunch of stuff at work and you can still expect it to function the same as when you first put it on it's also immune to x-ray machines emps electrostatic discharges so you don't have to worry about taking it through airport security for example or a magnet messing up your crypto wallet don't let the durability of the ring fool you though it's super lightweight only four grams in comparison it makes my wedding ring feel super heavy at 13 grams. While I couldn't pick my size in the beta version, it does fit my pinky ring perfectly, and honestly, I forget that it's even there. The final version of the Tangem ring will be available in different sizes for sure, and possibly different colors, however, that is not confirmed yet. But I actually like the gloss black look of this ring. It's super inconspicuous, it doesn't draw any attention to my hand or to my wardrobe. It just looks like another ring. As for the price, it's unconfirmed, but my guess is it will probably fall between 100 and 150 dollars based on other rings on the internet that are made from the same material and then of course you have to factor in that it's a crypto wallet so there is a secure element chip in it along with the nfc antenna it will also support the same number of tokens and blockchains that the current tangent wallet supports which is more than 7,000 tokens now as far as when you'll be able to buy this ring tangent said it should be available in quarter one of 2024 so between january and march of 2024 to be the first to know when this ring drops and for a special discount make sure you are subscribed to the channel okay so how does the ring work if you have used a tangent wallet before it works nearly identical to the cards you can create a new wallet by holding your ring up to your phone tapping create wallet set up your backup cards and you're good to go the beta ring doesn't support generating or importing seed phrases but it should in the final production phase just like the new tangent wallets do to initiate and approve transactions it's the same thing as a card you simply hold it up to your phone and that will be your digital signature to approve any transaction that you do using the tangent app now of course there are other security features that would prevent someone from accessing all of your crypto if they got a hold of your ring such as biometric authentication as well as a user generated passcode so you don't have to worry too much if you lose your tangent ring i mean yeah it sucks because you'll have to to buy a new one if you want another ring but at least you'll know that no one else can access your wallet one of the questions that i've been asked most about the tangent ring is if you can replace one of your three existing tangent cards with the ring and the answer is no technically however if you generated your tangent wallet using a seed phrase there is one workaround i actually see assuming you have your seed phrase recorded as you should you can take your cards reset them all to factory settings and then when you go to create a new wallet you import your seed phrase and instead of activating all three of your cards make sure to activate your ring so you can have your ring as your primary card and then use your two cards as a backup and that's the only way i see this working but if you generated your current tangent cards without a seed phrase you would not be able to do this because if you reset those cards to factory settings you will lose all of your crypto so this is only for people who generated their cards using a seed phrase that they can then import into the tangent wallet ring who knows maybe tangent will come up with a better method Method for implementing the ring into your current tangent wallet lineup maybe they'll let you add four total wallets i have no idea how that works but uh, i suppose it's possible but if you're looking for a workaround what i just mentioned is the only way i see this working now the main reason i made this video is because i want to hear your feedback about the tangent ring what do you think what can be improved what do you wish the ring could do 
let me know and I will make sure to relay all of your comments directly to Tangem. And if you want a more in-depth view about how the Tangem ring will work, make sure to check out my full review of the Tangem wallet because it works basically the same. I'll see you in the next video.